Wine. Why? This is SJ Duelist Sukan of Clansmoke Jaguar Bed Galaxy Living Legends. This is a battle between Point Commander 3 Carbonell and Point Commander 1 Templar. They are each in lights on TSA Carbon. The winner will advance in rank, the loser will drop in rank. I certify that both of you are in correct assets. This is a battle to the defeat of your opponent. May no one interfere. This battle has begun. Good luck to you, gentlemen. Channel switched. User was moved to your channel. Hmm. User was moved channel to your switched. channel. I knew these new TeamSpeak channel layouts would work, and people are actually using it. I'm happy. So, what do you guys think? Cougar Delta for Templar and. Excuse me. Cougar Carbon's e. gonna win. Cougar E for Templar and Carbon and Oblivion Prime. Carbon's gonna win. He's gonna see Templar. Templar is gonna take Oolong to get back. Carbon's gonna close the gap, and Templar is just gonna lose. That's just how that's going to work. On this bat, myself personally, I'd be grabbing the most energy heavy thing I could due to the coldness. Non existent heat? Yes. Sorry, guys, what's the password? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Okay. But no, but Templar doesn't really have heat sinks in that, so he can alpha strike that all day. So you think the key will be. Uh, Templar has to see the enemy first and has to get away after firing the first shot to have a chance here. Um, he's going to need to, more or less, yeah, do that. Neither of these mechs have, excuse me, the pool. Yeah, neither of these mechs have GECM. So unless they're both running hot, this could take a while, even though it's a small map. How would you beat that Puma Prime if you were Templar? Like, what uh, your, your play style? Where would you go, uh, and, and, and how quick would your engagements be? For this, uh, even of one, I wouldn't have taken. Well, I mean, Templar could probably get away with the uh, with that cougar. That's more of a support mech, just because of how dependent it is on the team, its team that it's on to help it out, not get rushed. I would have picked something that had brawly stuff on it. Uh, LDX, maybe some sort of auto cannon. Go in completely invisible until I found carbon. Mm -hmm. But then again, I was denied brawl brawling all day, so yeah, that's why. Now, what do you think of uh, Carbonell's decision to go to such a high point on this map in the center? Carbon's at a high point. Templar. Oh, I'm sorry. Yes, uh, t Templar. He can he can see well, but does he have enough cover here? And are there egress routes for him? First and foremost, he needs to wait until Carbon is at least 500 meters away, and then start shooting. The reason why he wants to do that is Carbon can outrange Templar. Templar is going to have to shoot and scoot in order to actually get good hits on uh, Carbon, but in order for him to win, he can't get hit by those PPCs constantly. Well, the PPCs do have a longer reload time, but uh, if they hit, they are just... Oh! Yeah. Uh, I don't know, Proxy, is that hit on Templar? I couldn't see. Carbon got hit. As far as I could tell, I think that they might have been out of range or might have hit only one <laughs> Oh, carbon missed. Templar. Templar jumping down. Bad decision. Bad decision. And I think he had to jump down because he could. And jumping back up. Bad decision. He needs to reposition somewhere else. Carbon's gonna just. Uh, carbon has more armor here. He's just gonna line up his shot again on that torso. And the ATMs aren't going to do shit. I don't know. He's just showboating now, Proxima, with the flamers. Carbon's just going to keep closing the gap. There's really nothing Templar can do at this point. He needs to be spreading the damage as soon as his lasers don't fire like Carbonell just did. Like that. Like one more Alpha Strike and this is over, Proxima. This particular situation, 
Templar might have had a decent chance because all those all the weapons are in the arms. If he might have been able to keep doing like you said, moving away fast enough, he might have been able to get, get one arm off, get, get both arms off, and then he had a chance. But as soon as he fell off that mountain, this was over. Uh, on behalf of SJ Proxima, this is SJ Duelist. We thank you for watching the SJ Network as Carbonell moves up to rank 4 point commander and, well, Templar stays point 1. We'll see you next time.